responsible. Just for you, Chemical. And you're right. You're right. Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> but it's the representation. <laughs> of see the <laughs> disorder. <laughs> Can we, is this your yeah. 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 Thank you so much, Steve. I just don't want to sit in the rocker. I'm gonna switch you over. I wasn't gonna switch you. No, it's not. Ah! Never. I could have taken the big car. You're gonna find this dream interesting. I don't know when if we'll do it, but... Yes? Yeah, sure. You have a dream? Okay. Oh, I have a dream. The point is, is that... This morning, I just got Play Mandarin, finish. Awesome. And I have a dream. What, what is this? Bring it. Let's just start off our body. Yes. It's in a new J... J... Up west. Sure. JMB production. The purple. Sure. What is it? I saw it. Here's one for you, sir. Grazie, grazie. Grazie, grazie. Ah, good. I doubled it because it wasn't gonna. There's four copies going that way. Oh, I think it's Steve Boyd. Something. Okay. Maybe Brian Boyd. Oh, that's good. Everybody has one. Regina has one. Right there. Got my wow. Okay. Oh wow. Yeah. It's more coffee press. Sure. Ah. Ah. Hi Regina, I put you a copy there. On your chair. Thank you. Okay, where am I here? Hmm. Saturday, September first, two thousand eighteen. Was that in the dream? No, I just always record them that way. Is this I always you? do that. The last night. Yeah, this morning. I, I didn't see a name on it. Oh, sorry. Yes, it's mine. Oh, no. Yeah, right. yeah. You're right. Just last night I was thinking people ought to put their names on dreams. And of course, I didn't. Mm. But you wrote it there, you typed it, so that's all you want to Really? I just barely made it. Sorry for all the mics. It's Technology Awareness Month. <laughs> is it really? Or is that just a joke? Um, I've had so many I've had so many microphone breakdowns last ah. month. I'm just putting backups just in case. Ah. Go for it. You're on, you're online. Well, Pierre's looking through it. <laughs> what did you get to that part where you're starring? <laughs> <clears throat> Not yet. No, I'm such a slow reader. I'm still mm. recorded. It's shouting at you. Mm -hmm. I can really. Yeah, I, I read. I read pretty slowly too.
normally bother about these messages from the mind? I don't think of it as bother. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Then you tolerate it. <laughs> um, or find it interesting? Well, actually, this morning was good. I remembered that I had one to. Uh, I have a lot of. I thought, I have time to transcribe it. But then. Oh, there it is. You don't go, I need to go yeah. any further. Okay. You say it again. I have time to transcribe it. What did you say? I said, yes. Thank you for thinking of yourself, Julie. And did you? Oh, no, I ate and then went back to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> See? Mm. You said something just a moment ago that captured the essence of it. Oh. Okay, sorry. That I had, hey, you have time to... I don't know what's your response to it. Oh, yeah. To what? A response to that. Yeah. Yes, it was, it was interesting, very meaningful, yeah. like a thing. A gem. A transition or something, a gem, yeah. Yeah, I was surprised. It should be on my tape, from actually. Remembering that. On remembering videos. myself. I was, it was cool. But you turn and see, that phrase Wait. competed with that and knocked it out. Hmm. Do you think you said something or not? I just made it up. I'll listen to the tape. Julie's dream or Barbara's? Mine. Yeah. So let's see. Oops, wrong one. Okay. Hmm. Oh. I can't get the volume. Come on, Betty. Oh. I said I don't think of it as bothering. That was the uh, the preceding I discussion. Said, not tolerate, but that was preceded. Welcome, I welcome it. That's true, but that wasn't mm. the re remark. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. I don't really know how to get this fast forward without a computer I could do. It's okay. okay. <clears throat> oh, you need a pen? Yeah, get right over there. Is that clipboard, infamous clipboard here somewhere? Let me find it. Uh, I've got one. And a pen. And a pen. I have a pen on my packet. Oh, the sound of coffee being enjoyed by Pierre. <laughs> when the, it, record, it picks up pretty well. We can find. I, I can find it later if you want it. But okay. It's okay. Did you? No. Shall I continue to try? I didn't know what the okay meant. Exactly what I said. I said, why didn't you work Sunday? <laughs> 
Saturdale. Uh, 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 so that's just me. No, I'm an overthinker. We could all just change our routine, you know? <laughs> yeah, there you go. We're missing. I know. I know. He wanted to come. <laughs> He's really good. Are you guys picking up books today? Mm -hmm. Oh, I just was curious. Go ahead. I don't pick up his father. <laughs> oh, then you tolerate it. <laughs> oh. I'm going to find it interesting. Well, actually, this morning was good. I remembered that I had one to. Uh, I have a lot of. I thought, I have time to transcribe it. Okay. I have time to transcribe it. And it, it's contained enough. Yes. But and then, of oh, the in the that's the state. That's the transition away, oh. right? Did you hear it? Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Well, what did you make of it? But then, the yeah, that wasn't exactly how you did it. Well, I remember how. But yeah. I remember that I didn't do it, that I fell asleep. Oh, it sounded like you got a thought that turned you away from That's right. doing it. Right then. Oh. That's what it sounded like. Mm -hmm. Like, as if well, you now saw a greater good or something, a great or a greater pleasure or, right, some kind of positive thing that... Me, you regarded it as I must have. positive, but it was a tangent. Well, I must have. I, mean, mm. I didn't type it up. Then. Yeah. I don't know what it was. Okay. We'll we'll catch it again. I mean, I went to I went to go type it, but then I got you know I've got this cat next door that's staying at my house. Uh, you did it again. Hmm. But then yeah. I got another butt oh. Yeah. I got a lot of butt dams. What does that mean? Hmm. But then, but then, I don't, <laughs> I don't know. It sounds intriguing. It's like a little storybook or something. Yeah, go ahead. Then the monster came. That's right. It's like a, a yeah. It's, it's like a chapter. Yeah. Something big. Yeah. Especially because your state of mind before it is, seems very high, doesn't it? Yeah, it's very high. You know, like, like I'm on my way to. I saw the light. <laughs> But then, but then, that's see, it. and that's but interesting. The, the hand and the eyes. Do you notice each time she says it, she uses her hand in the same way? I won't this time because I'm going to be holding three things. <laughs> <laughs> you use the other one. <laughs> but then. <laughs> that's right. That's right. <laughs> see, I told you. So? Yeah. Right. Uh, watch. <laughs> that's good. Now the foot gets in it, right? Yeah. Say, that's a really a great expression, isn't it? It is. Try to say it without moving. But then, well, now I've got to change my voice. And you got to right. do your head. Now I got to get expressive in another way. But then, yeah. The head moves with it. Yeah, the yeah, head and the shoulders. Yeah. Then, <laughs> that has a long Jeez. history. Apparently. But then... <laughs> but then again... Uh, oh! It might not. What does that do? Wow, that was interesting. It was but then squared. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, I don't recall ever hearing it. I, I don't it's not care like about I really... Yeah, yeah, yeah. It doesn't ring a bell. Of course not. <laughs> By the way, you do it all the time, don't you? But it doesn't ring a bell. Yeah, I agree. It makes me hot. <laughs> but then we are kind of doing the whole But then I got hot. Take your right foot out. Always a good time well, for me. Well, thanks for pointing that out. I'll keep my eye out or my ear. Well, but but then. But then I might forget. <laughs> See, that fits. Yeah, that does fit. Yeah. Yeah, it's weird. Mm -hmm. I got a I got a song you might like. It's uh it's called But Then I Got High. 
<laughs> and it's like, you know, I was going to record my dream and do all my work. Uh -huh. but, but then I got That's high, a good one. Right? That's or a good whatever, title. Whatever That's you want to put there. Song, but then, yeah. No, it'd be really good to track yeah, yeah. what state of mind that uh -huh. was right there. Right. Yeah. Just got that whole body into it. And yeah. The gesture and, the, you know, got a history to it. Yeah. But it doesn't remind her of anything. No. So it's been with her for the number of years. Mm. She's probably buried the. I would origin. guess 64 years. Oh, hmm. oh, oh. Let go to your dream. Okay. <clears throat> what age you think I shouldn't? Years. She isn't 64 years old. Oh. <clears throat> okay. So this. <clears throat> what do you make of it? I I almost had the feeling it was a global dream. I don't. The mind. same problem occurring in like three different places where hmm. the conversation going on and on and on and on and on and there's no resolution. That's true. All the conversations are going on and on and on and on. And this is a question I had because I, I'm very, it's only in the last year that I said to people, look, this conversation isn't going anywhere. And I think I've only done it maybe three times in my whole life to say, this isn't going anywhere. We need to move on to another topic. Mm -hmm. So that's what I was doing. But this is the first time I think I've done it in a <clears throat> philosophical discussion was last night. I noticed that. So That was well done, wasn't it? I don't know. That's it. I, I ended up walk, going home and going, if you were more philosophical, you wouldn't have said that. You know, so I have this whole, if you had, you know, you just don't, you're not like Pierre. Pierre would never say that. And that was my that's, That's my thought. Like, oh, okay. Yeah. okay, but so you can see. Um, What's the mark of each of the discussions? Well, <clears throat> some of them. Well, like David's part, he's considering what is important to him. I think, like one person might say, "Oh well, it's a wedding. Shouldn't he give it up?" But they, he doesn't know them in the dream. They aren't friends or family, so. I felt like he was um, holding on to his guns, you know, kind of like, I'm not doing this. I, I get it that he's not being rude. He's not being rude. He's not being uh, angry or ugly or anything. He's just saying, this will be worth a lot of money. I'm going to hold on to it. So I don't know. The mark of each of them, though. Well, See, that, that, I, have, I don't know if I've ever been in a dream where everybody in the room was talking all the time. And this, the room was filled. It was a big room, probably twice this size, and you know, wider and twice as long. And every, every square yard had people talking in it. So, um, And you asked me the mark of the conversations. Well, hmm, everybody was involved in them. Some of the topics I might think were more worthwhile than others. But that wasn't in the dream. That In the dream? Yeah, I wasn't evaluating. I, they were just going on. Yeah. yeah. Um, uh, let's see. Well, people were talking about things that mattered to them. That's a mark of the conversation. So there really wasn't any desultory conversation. Most people were very intense about it. I mean, the intensity varied, but they, but nobody was like casual about whether they were talking or not. They weren't dismissive or relaxed or not caring. They all were involved. Very engaging conversation. Go to the mm -hmm. next one, please. Sorry. Go ahead. You were asking me to go ahead yeah, about the comparison yeah. or read the dream, or? The, the next case is good. The next case? Yeah. Oh. Um, the Jeff case? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Well, suddenly I'm looking at this iPad or something, and I'm seeing pictures of Jeff and Sam's house and a party, similar party, in their house. And, and I'm thinking, this is, is online. And Jeff wouldn't want, I think he wouldn't want it to be online. I, I wonder if he knows, you know, because of recent 
I think it's because of the background of recent uh, things you've talked about. So, um, I, but somehow I didn't make it to talk to him by the end of the dream. I didn't put it down in the dream, so I'm not sure of the, you know, like I didn't go, okay, I'll do this later. Um, but, uh, yeah, it seems significant to me, especially when I figured it might be on the university website. It's one thing, perhaps, to be on a private website or somebody's <coughs> private Instagram feed or something, but if it's being posted on a university website, then it's very public. And um, it would be a locator. I don't know if that's, you know, what tracking thing. No, no. Okay, so I thought he should know, even though it isn't something I personally worry about, but mm -hmm. he's a friend and it's something he worries about. So is that what you mean by that? Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, it's interesting though. I do feel a real need, but I don't go up to him in the dream. I don't, like I could stand up, walk over and go, oh. take a look at this. Yeah. Um, and that's pretty common in me that I don't often feel that what I have to say is important. Mm -hmm. Enough to interrupt somebody. I don't know how to feel bad. <laughs> no, I'm just laughing because lately I've taken the... Oops, I can't find them. Oh, my God. Putting Kleenex in my pockets. <laughs> but I guess I, they fell out. That's okay. I, I, thank you, though. Well, it's on the cabinet next to the light in the, by the drapes. So, that is... No. Uh, uh, I didn't hear you. Could you say that again? Um... I said I don't go up to Jeff in the dream because I usually don't think that things are that I that what I have to say is important enough to interrupt someone's conversation. Oh. oh. What, what is that, you? Well, it's kind of weird. It's kind of, because on the one hand, it's part of the usual way I talk to myself. You know, it's like part of my my logos to myself is that. You know, don't, don't, it's a dialogue going on or a, di or a discussion or conversation and what I have to say can wait or not be said at all. Uh, I, I have a bad memory. Could, could you tell me that again? That what I have to say, yeah. that it's part of my normal way of, of being in a conversation. If I'm listening yeah. to a conversation, I won't say what is on my mind. Because I think, I don't think it's important enough to, uh, yeah. or um, that the conversation should go yeah. on without yeah. it. Yeah. yeah, especially if it's not, yeah, some kinds of points that are supportive, I will say, if they are supportive, um, or if I, th so but there I are like, a few I that I, yeah, yeah, heavy I, duty I, I, judgments. I like that state that mm. you get into. Of not saying, of not speaking, or no. of being supportive? No. No. Which one? I forgot it again. Ah. Uh, uh, could you go over it again? The one about not interrupting a conversation because what I'm saying is not important? That part. What I'm thinking? Yeah. 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 Um, yeah. It's very weird. It yeah. almost doesn't matter what the conversation because is about. Of, because of that logo. It, yeah, and because, not, like, I don't really make a comparison. No. And it, I, it's, it's like I have I, no way of judging. No, no, it's final. Uh, it does pretty much shut me down, yeah. Yeah, it's final. And then I don't have anything to contribute at all of once course, I make that judgment. Because then, yeah. Uh, uh, say, what is it like when you say that to yourself? I don't think I have anything. It important. feels very much like. Um, it feels like warm oatmeal. Oh, good. Which I really hate. It's like bland. It's like a state of everything turns into blandness of. Um, and mushiness and unflavored, you know. 
Um, yeah, but, but what is the effect it has on you then? That mushiness and uh, that? Well, I completely, it kills me off. I have no vitality after oh. that. Yeah, it, I see that. That's quite right. It has no vitality. But what effect does it have on you? Well, I have no vitality. Yeah. I, yeah. I, oh, what effect does it have on me? It shuts me up, mm. and um, it kind of um, makes my my state goes to a like a neutral or like a continue like there's certain a range that it'll go to, and it's none of it has any excitement or enjoyment. It's like being along for the ride, you know, and not, yeah. and it's a particularly boring ride. Yeah, yeah. We've had that a long time. Where does it go? Hmm. Well, there were a lot of rides where, in my family, we used to drive on vacation. Huh? And somehow I have in my image of myself sitting in the car, backseat of the car, and we're going somewhere. And I'm probably... Four or five. Well, this one is particular, like maybe eight. Oh, good. But, um... I'll take it. Yeah. And, well, I just remember that it seems so tedious, so boring. It's like so... <sighs> yeah, that's right. You, it just, um... Um... I think we were going to my grandmother's house, and my grandmother's house was really, really boring. And my grandmother... Do you have a mixed copy of the drink? Oh, sure. I have two, in fact. Okay, that's what we need. Do I have one more? Ooh. Okay. Yep, that both green is good. <laughs> What's underneath is not. Um, so I think I'm on my way to my grandmother's house, and my 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 my, my parents are acting like it's significant, something we need to do. Um, but nobody there plans to have a good time. You know. Careful. Nobody there. So we're going to my dad's mother, and it's like we have to make this trip to my dad's mother and uh, visit her. And when we get there, we're there for hours. And. Um, so, uh, what do you think of that, that? That keeps going on and on. Well, hmm. And no one says anything. And it's hard to see the necessity. And, no one says and nobody says anything. Mm -hmm. And nobody makes it better. I mean, there were things that could be done that, like, to make it better. They could bring something to do. They could take us somewhere before or after that would make it more palatable. They could take her with us somewhere so that we'd go somewhere where everybody would have something more to do. They could engage you in some discussion. Yes. That's right. They could. Well, my parents don't talk to us. They really don't talk to us. Oh, well, that's the. Yeah, it's a milieu. Yeah, they could engage us. My aunt, my grandmother could engage us, because we go there because we are her only grandchildren. That's one of the reasons. Yeah. And my dad wants to show off because he has children and his brother doesn't. Yeah. And his brother's. Now, the what, do you, what do you call that? Tolerating that. I never thought of any doing anything else, you know. It's, uh, uh, but I, but I get you. Tolerating that is like it becomes a standard for life somehow. Yeah. You know, it becomes mm -hmm. every. It's okay if everything is like that. If you never have any fun going anywhere. Yeah. That if everything is. Um, so, uh, consider you're in the car. God, I feel like I'm not saying anything worthwhile. You're doing. Yeah, you're in it. Right? It's not true. Yep. Yep. Right. Yeah. <laughs> at, at that moment, you're in the back of the car, and you feel the way you feel right now. Yeah. 
What should you tell the right uh, people in the first row? Run, <laughs> in the front seat. Yeah, 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 yeah. What? You know. What should you tell them? Yeah, what are we doing this for? There's no reason to do this the way it stands, folks. You know, you are not engaging us. She's not going to engage us. You're not going to engage her. Nothing meaningful will take place. Nothing fun will take place. What do you know? Is this the kind of life you guys have been living? Is this what your parents, you know, initiated you into the life of boringness, of non engagement, of like being a it's like being a balloon on a string where they just drag you along with them and then they drag you back and there's no you don't ever do anything. See, nothing for you there, but you see, you got them. I get the moment where the family drama is it's visible. Taking, yeah, the family non-drama is visible. Right. Well, yeah, the total repression of any right. of any yeah instinct yeah. or yeah. drive. So, by the way, you have the power. Right, right. I mean, although uh, you're saying right, they're not. They're not. You and I could say something to them, but they very likely would respond in exactly the same way. You know, they would, like, s squish it down so it has no meaning. Like, they would ignore me, very likely, as if I had said nothing. Uh, and even if I... Yeah, and at that moment, what should you tell them? Uh, yeah, I could point that out. I could say, ignore me or don't. It doesn't matter, because you're hearing me, and this is true, and your life has been like this. And that's because your parents gave you that model for living. And I'm not going to stand for it anymore. I've lived my life this way. That's it. No more. You can go on this trip without me. Uh, or, you know. <laughs> it's true. It's only a day trip. But you see, you're going to the, the grandparents. Your grandparents. Yes. Yeah, I could say. I could say that, you know, let, let's talk to Grandma about her life and who taught her this way of living. Yep. You could put, you have the power at that moment to expose the entire Oh, that's thing. true. All the level, all the, you know, and it's like, hey, this is no longer the depression, folks. Get over yourselves. You all have a nice lifestyle here. But then you don't have to live on onion sandwiches, for yeah. God's sake. But it's only if you don't take the power and exhibit it and show it that you're in a bland state. Right, stage. right, right. So what are you going to do with that power? Well, I think it would be good to engage them all and not let them off the hook just because they're sitting there apparently unaffected by it. Yeah. You know, yeah. like keep asking them yeah. in different ways the same question. Yeah. Yeah. What do you make of that last scene now in the dream? Oh, man. But you mean the one where I'm... By the way, you, you alternately say, ah, women. <laughs> Actually, you know what happens? I gave away my copy. Can I look at... Okay. Thank you. Yeah, it's interesting to see. There's n another part where I'm in it, I believe. With Sir Winston, yeah. That one? Sorry, say, say what? Oh, Sir Winston. Sir Winston... Um, I couldn't recall very much of that section of the dream that he, but it was like he was a noble figure in it. Yeah. He wasn't just a and I am empty at, title. And I am being asked to engage in a dialogue. Read it. Yes. Go ahead. Right. And I'm being, a, um, I'm being asked to engage in a dialogue, a discussion, a dialogue, and I'm declining. I'm saying, I'm sorry but we've been through this countless times before. I'm not going to talk about it again. I'm not going to enter back into this discussion again. It doesn't go anywhere. I'm not doing it. You changed a couple of words. I'm sorry, but we've been through this countless times no, before. From the beginning. Well, I'm being asked. I'm being asked to get involved in a discussion, a dialogue. I left out discussion because it was a correction no, you to said say. to engage in discussion. That's okay. That's okay. okay. Yeah. Especially since uh, yeah, okay. I'm the dreamer. Yeah. I get to do that. Yeah. But thank you. Sorry. What do you really think is going on there? The well, you know what's interesting? That's kind of playing out 
that would be a playing out of the problem that we've just been discussing. Yeah. If I were to engage in a discussion that we've been through countless times before that never goes anywhere, it's like being on that trip, mm -hmm. right? And having to shut down uh, critical commentary on it. Yeah, what's different about it? Well, I am articulating it and giving the reasons why. True. Um, yeah, it's interesting. The whole language of I'm not going to enter back into this discussion again. Yeah, I mean, just, but which, what do you, just read it again. Okay. Uh, I believe, uh, okay. Yeah. I right. believe, uh, but there's another part where I'm in it. I believe in this part of the dream. I'm in this part of the dream, I'm being asked to get involved in a discussion, a dialogue, and I'm declining. That's enough. With Sir Winston. You know, uh, yeah, I don't know that that's true, but it could be true. Absolutely could be true. Could be. I just, I remember... And your image of Sir Winston? Is that he's a, uh, he's a nobleman of the old school, kind of. He has a certain carriage... Uh, by the way, would it be an ideal person to dialogue with? Might have been, yeah. Might have been an ideal person to dialogue with. Because he seemed pretty to have an integrity, and I, but... Um, but you're plugging in your past at that moment. Right. Yeah, as I said, I'm not sure those go together, but on the assumption they do go together, yes. I'd be plugging, because I wouldn't have talked with him before. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, and that, I don't think I would have played that card if it was a matter of the conversation with him, because that uh, is, a, is the card I only play if I've already been in the conversation with the th same person. But, but um, let me think. Then this is the exception. You think so? Hmm. Well, well no, no. I'm, I'm open to considering it. I'm not... No denying that the possibility um, um, what's it like in the dream when you're being asked to engage in the dialogue hmm that helps that that there's more of a connection there possibly to Sir Winston in recalling that state of mind it um, uh, What's it like? Um, it's like being pulled from your hara, you know, like someone grabbing a hold of your hara and pulling you mm -hmm. out. Mm -hmm. um, um, yeah, I'd say that your analysis or what you're seeing there is right, that um, I'm applying something from my past to that situation where my gut, so to speak, is telling me um, that I'm involved in it. Yeah. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? That it would be good for me to have that conversation. Yeah. Because it's, it's yeah. I, the other kind of conversation. Mm. But you see, that would be the ideal discussion to have with him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, uh, about what is in, what is in. That very statement you made. Hey, this is what I'm thinking. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Th I mean, it, it would be real on my part and yeah. probably on his as well. Right. Yeah. Hmm. So your dream is giving you uh, like an archetypal... Situation where not to play the game? <laughs> no, no. To or play not the to game. So examine the game. Examine the game. Okay. Right. Yeah. So therefore, is it not important to know what it was like, finish it at that last statement. What did it do to you? You said it was like having your horror pulled away from you. Pulled out. Pulled out. Yeah, like yeah. not separated, but, yeah. but like um, a t uh, attached or something yeah. like that. What's that like? Um, it feels kind of painful. Um, it's very intense. Yeah, it's sure, very. It's sure. almost like like your hara is made of um, some is uh, some in the sense of somebody really grabbing a hold of it, 
and stretching it when it doesn't normally go in that direction. Right. Or, right. Yeah. So in a way it's being pulled out, yeah. right? Like coming out, yeah. being forced out, being forced to come out. Yeah. Uh, what is that do to you at that moment? What did that, yeah, yeah, when I said that you mean? or Yeah, that's when I, what happened. That's what happened. What did that do? I felt very revealed and therefore I felt doubly the desire to hide, pull back, pull back into my shell like a turtle that's or a snail. It's a, a very interesting state of mind. Yes. Put it together now, come on. It's well. Like the horror experience so by being pulled out. It would have been a very been good conversation. Hide. Uh-huh. Yeah, that I wanted to hide. Yeah. It would have been a very revealing conversation even to me, yeah. revealing something about myself that I didn't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Where does that stage go? Um, well, I remember the time, Remember, I remember one scene of a glass, that glass horse that I got. Mm -hmm. We had gone with my aunt to kind of exciting place, my aunt and uncle. And they had bought me a horse I really wanted. My parents hadn't wanted me to have. I thought it was so beautiful. And my parents absolutely acted like it didn't e exist. And they, but yet they managed to knock it out of the car and step on it. And that moment when they stepped on it, that's what that feeling was yeah, like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What should you have said at that moment? Come on. Maybe that I'm feeling like I'm... Go ahead. I'm, I'm feeling like I'm going to get stepped on. <laughs> Or my, what I most value is going to be. It was. They did it. They did it. Oh, you mean in that scene? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They what? did it. Oh, yeah. I should have said, you know, don't try to pull this bullshit on me. You did it on purpose. You didn't want me to have it. I see it. And, you know. Oh, what is so threatening about that little thing? Well, the th that was showing you you could really have something that you wanted uh -huh. in life. That made you, gave you joy. That's what they're against, you having joy. Especially that kind, because it was like their attitude was that it wasn't, it wasn't like buying shoes, you know. It was something that didn't have any usefulness in their eyes. Yeah. And that's what they kept saying to my aunt and uncle who said, I don't care. She wants it. We're going to get it for her. Yeah, go back to that moment. Again. Uh, yeah, to my parents, you mean? No, right there. Oh. Right. And they just demolished it, right? Right. And you said they didn't want you... To have anything that gave me joy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You saw something important about it. Wow. Yes, that they would kill anything. And then, yeah, it really had applicability to myself. I really felt like, I mean, that shows what they'll do if something or somebody is having joy they'll yeah. just so, if they're doing something that's only meaningful to them right. you know yeah. You, yeah. now you got their I whole, had a certain fear now, now you got their whole problem now visible in their hand uh-huh yeah well that they're really at war against what well in joy and right. and self um expression yeah. 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 And See. that could be said too, you know, it's like what you guys you guys must have never been permitted to have this state of joy in your lives. Yeah. And that means that someone had to teach you to do this by doing it to you. Right. And they in turn Right. They're joy stompers. They're, they want to keep you in the box of feelings that they consider, and what, the, socially the, acceptable or something? Sure, sure. I'll link that up with the bland. Yeah, it's bland. They want you to just be this bland person. At the most you do is a little tiny smile with closed lips, like, you know. Yeah. And no happiness or laughing or... So, playfulness. So at that moment, you had all the power. Yeah. Well, I could have said, you, you know. You had all the power. Yeah. You've really shown me, guys, 
how real this is to you, how much you hate this, any kind of state of mind of joy and freedom. You've shown me that. And, and somebody showed it to you, friends. But this will only last as long as I'm in your company. <laughs> as soon as I'm out of here, I'm going to blow this pop stand. Thank you. Yeah? Good show. Thank you very much. Uh, how do you account for the fact that the dream is giving you the whole key to your family's history and your own life? And wow. That, that well, you know what I find interesting? I'm just going to go back. I know, well, is the fact that it was shouting. <laughs> you know, is that I would close my eyes and it would be going, look at me now! <laughs> you know, and then I would fall asleep and then I would wake up to go to the bathroom and come back and it would be like right there going, oh, 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 oh. very, and that was really a benefit. Yeah, yeah. It's an urgency. An urgency. Right. Yeah. For you to deal with that. What, what is the issue again that you came to? What's well, the, that the, you're not the, I'm not, um, I'm not, it's like I'm not allowing myself to enter into those dialogues or activities that would give me joy and let me grow, yeah. right, and stretch out, reach out to something yeah. meaningful, a yeah. relationship. Yeah. And since they killed your hara, yeah. you're now? React, react, rebirthing it. Something. Right. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right. Surely. Sure. I've yes. got one too, oh. after Regina. Oh, good. Well, you want to do it? You're first? Okay. Go for it, go for it. Here's something bad. I want you to know, Dave, I defended you. Oh, hmm? that's the handwritten. You, star in my, you starred in my game, but I defended you. That said. Dave was doing the right thing. Well, I hope so. Well, yeah. Thank you. Um, this I, was I you were holding on to this beautiful pen. Gold shades, fountain pen, old, and um, a stack of paper that was so beautiful. Old, lush, heavy. And they were saying, we want, we want to use it. But they, you didn't want them. You didn't yeah. have to. And they didn't say, we'll pay you for it. They just said, we want to use your paper because it's really wonderful in your pen. And you were like, no. Mm. <laughs> So I wanted to say, and it might not have been obvious, but I was, I was on your side. And, and did it fit into the dream? Uh, oh, yeah. Make your understanding? Yeah. Yeah, it's very Yeah, because it's, it's about oh, something that's so right. You hand wrote yeah. yours, too? Obviously, I did. You Thank you. Oh, okay. you. Thank you. Thank you. And you were not going to give it up for something that was <coughs> to you. Uh -huh. You weren't going to the wedding. Did you, see, did you see John McCain's speech? Oh, yeah, there's the problem. I mean, uh, Obama's speech. There's the problem. Yeah. Wow. I watched the speech yeah. when he gave it live. Yeah. Yeah. Obama's speech. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. No, yeah. 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 I'm going to go back and watch all this because I can't see what's happening. There's the problem right there. How about Gina? Did we run out of copies of here? No, there should be enough. So we're doing Regina's first. Did you get yours? I didn't get one. Do you have one? Oh, I have no, but I have two. Did you get an extra? Yeah. They're both handwritten. No. Okay. One's Jeff. One, one, one's Jeff and one's... Okay. Yeah, one's Jeff's one's Jeff. There should be enough. Okay, I got one. Thank you. I'm good. Oh, maybe there isn't. Okay, sorry.
furnace as possible. Furnace? Uh, where's it? Uh, a furnace as possible. That was a thought. Furnace? Was it? Would it be the through the furnace? Uh, Sorry. The furnace as possible. Through the oh, furnace as possible. I see. You could you could communicate to them through the furnace. Through the furnace. furnace. It was a thought. So okay. I just. You didn't have a this is what I said on the tape. So. They can send valuables and chill something. Children. Oh, children. This, the se second line I'm getting, is that, is that foundation with a prefix? What line? Uh, the second line I'm getting, getting information. information. <laughs> Gina, there's no more? There's not. There's On no the back part. Oh, there is. Oh. Can you read it? Yeah, sure. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Uh, another quick question, just reading it. Second line from the bottom, wrapping on the metal side beams to alert. Uh, create noise. Create noise. Was that a thought you were having about a possibility of something you could do, or did you mean you you yourself were wrapping? That's on what metal? we were doing. You were doing. Mm -hmm. uh, we were doing it, you and the others? Yeah. Okay. okay. Well, I was doing it, but there were others. I don't have any of my other dreams. They're all on my computer, and I don't have my computer, so. Mm -hmm. This is the one that came last night. Oh. What do you make of the dream? Odd. Hmm? No, 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 odd. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Well, it looked like we were trying to solve a problem that was serious. And I was working on something that uh, I think that I don't, I, the idea of suddenly I thought of old buildings yeah. of having the mail drops. That was a sh that was a surprise because I was mm -hmm. really working at trying to figure out how to deal with this. Yeah. Yeah. And it and it worked <coughs> because there was a mail shoot. Huh? She got inside. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was. It was like talk. the elevator and, and laundry chute or laundry chute would have been dangerous for the yeah. kids. But yeah. for some reason, the it wasn't very big, but it would have taken care of little kids. Yeah. They would have, because it was confined, yeah. it would have been <clears throat> safer. You they would have had to travel pretty fast, yeah. but we would be at the bottom. You could, you could talk about what it was like to have that in that moment of sin. Oh, that moment? Yeah. 
Um, sudden one? Well, there were two suddens. One was like seeing that there was a problem with we needed to communicate through all the floors. There was just no question about it. It's like we could walk away and say, okay, well, we would leave them. But I just, I just for some reason said no, and that was a sudden, there was a sudden turnaround, like, we're not gonna do that. Yeah. And, and the second? The second one was, oh, that was really, <laughs> Like that was just like out of nowhere. It came. Up. It was a thought that it just didn't fit. It wouldn't be logical. It's not calculated. It's all. It's there. Yeah. What was it like? That moment of seeing that possibility. Uh, what was it like at that moment? Yeah. Um, oh, wow, I was happy. More. I mean, because I said, oh, this is a possibility and good one. Um, See, uh, it's likely that you've had insights in your life. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, where would you rate that oh, one? That one? That experience. Um, that experience. Not the content, the experience. Uh, the experience. Um, oh, universal. It was, it was, um, I would rate it as high. Uh, I, mean, it's, I, I, don't, I don't know. Well, on the scale of 1 to 10, I, th I would rate it as 10 because it involved me and myself and everything I was doing. Yeah. Like I was including myself, yeah. I was part of it. Yeah. I came to the idea and it was universe, it would help everyone. Yeah. Right, I had all of those. It, <coughs> and cover, it was universal. <coughs> it was, but it wasn't so much the insight, the content, as you pointed out. Uh, the difference was that it was gra um, grabbing. I mean, it was like, it came from nowhere. <laughs> the, the thought came from nowhere. It was unexpected, unpredictable, all that. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I wanted to make sure I heard you. Go ahead. And I think the way that I related to it was positive. Like, it was unpredictable, it was unexpected. But it seemed like the foundations were present for me to be able to accept it as not something that was out of the ordinary or mm -hmm. that it seemed to fit very well. <clears throat> I liked the idea. <laughs> and when yeah. I saw the mail drop, I liked it. Yeah. 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 I thought, this yeah. is good. So, how would that experience compare with Zen states? Uh, very similar. Very, mm. very similar. Mm. It made sense. Yeah. But uh, this one was more personal. Yeah. What's the problem in the dream, Jenna? What's the problem in the dream? I don't know. Now you're moving to a problem. Um, no. It w I think it was the idea of the levels. I'm not sure if, if no. that's the correct one, but I remember looking up through the mail chute and whether there was an end to it or whether that was the end. No, that's true. And I think I just concluded that no. it, it, I couldn't see the end. No, no, no. But other than that, no, I don't yeah. know what the... Yeah, uh, would you read the last sentence of the dream? The last sentence? Yeah. Uh, let's <clears> see, we had to try it was the only... What's that like? We had to try. What's that like in the dream? <coughs> what was that like? Um, 
um, well, we had to try. Um, Read the whole thing. Sure. We had to try. It was the only way to communicate for now to inform yeah. of danger. Yeah. Yeah. What, what's that like? Uh, we. What's commitment. That we, what does that we do to that statement? We? Um, uh, it includes um, no. the people that are around me, oh, like we were all working on this. Oh, would they then have to finish it? In terms of that idea you have? Yes, they would agree. Or we were agreeing, actually. Yeah, 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 yeah we yeah, had yeah. to try, so it was yeah, including everybody yeah. agreed. Yeah, yeah. What do you find curious about that last sentence? We had to try it was yeah. the only way to communicate for yeah, now. Yeah. Well, maybe the for now, I don't know. It was So far, that was the only way to communicate. I agree. What's interesting about that last sentence? That's why I had an interest in wondering how, what you experienced at that moment. Well, I guess it was like that was the reality at this that's point. True. Yeah, that's I true. don't yeah. know what. Yeah, that's true. Um, Um, it was, it was like going into the unknown. I don't know. It was like we didn't know whether it would work. We had to do it. It was the only one that we could come up with at that moment. Maybe we could come up with something else, but it was yeah. like we had to try because it was, un yeah. although it may have been unknown, we didn't yeah. know. Yeah. And just stepping into the unknown. Right. We had to try it. Yeah was yeah. the only way to... What's that like? Well, in the dream, it was yeah. uh, clear. More. A very directed and committed and determined. Now finish the sentence. But... Um, but didn't know whether it would work. I mean, what does that mean now? You're quite right. We had to try it. It was the only way to communicate for it, now to inform of danger. It, it, does the drama of the dream complete itself, or is there that wonder at the end of it of whether or not it would be effective? D yeah, I mean, we, we didn't know. Yeah. We, but we had to try. I yeah. mean, it, w it, was, <clears throat> it was our only alternative. At that point, maybe something else came up, but yeah. that but was what, what we had. Well, but what did I just say? I forgot. Well, was there some... No, I don't know. What did you say? You said... What? Is there something yet to be done? Is it, has it been, com is it the story as it were completed? Did you find out whether it would work or not work? Well, that's what we were going to do. I understand that. But has, have I done that in the dream? That's correct. Does the dream leave that open? Hmm. Um. Yeah, I thought for some reason, but I, okay. I think what I had done when I saw the, the shoot was I did hit it and I thought, oh yeah, this is what, this would work. But 
it would require a different direction. So to answer your question, that direction did not actually take place in the dream. Mean? That would be the next step. Okay, we've all agreed. Let's do it. Let's pound and get stuff to do it. Yeah. yeah. What does that mean? What does that mean? Yeah. Well, it means that that's the next step to do it. Mm. Or not? Ju and, yeah. And, and to do it so with the intent of what we want to do it with. You had a great idea. Very yeah. high, very high idea. Right. Gave you a possible solution. Right. And involved working with others to achieve that goal. Right. Was it achieved, or is that yet to be done, determined? It yet to be determined. Oh, what does that mean? I don't know. It's yet to be de whatever it me relates to. It's yet to be determined. That's true. See, now we're trying to figure out how to express that in, in, in terms of the dream itself, to say. I understand you had a great idea. Right. Yeah, yeah. When you shared it, other people went along with you. Yep. It has yet to be realized. That's our next step, yep. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What is that saying about your, the way you are going, you are functioning. What is left for you to do? To complete it. Yes. To actually see whether it works and what happens. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Is that rather interesting to you? Um. Especially since, see, it's the importance of sure. the word we in that. Mm -hmm. It isn't a solitary, see, it's a solar, solitary insight, but you got others to go along with you, and now you have to work towards the solution by bringing them along with you. That has yet to be done. Right. I would, I would actually be doing it, I yes. knew that, yeah. but... It, it was like as soon as I had the insight, yeah. everybody recognized it. Yeah, I want to go back to but the we other part. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay, go back. What's the dream pointing out to you that needs to be done? Then? It needs to be completed. Mm. Or... It's not so much complete as much as ne the next step yeah. to see if, if it works. Right. right, right. Because we don't know if it works. Right. You have to confirm it. Right, confirm it. Yeah. Find that interesting? Mm. Then it's not the experience itself alone that's significant, but what? Confirming it. Ah. Well, I don't understand that. Clearly. In terms of the dream, I, I, I can see it, but I was thinking of some. Okay. Mm. Well, I don't. I mean, like in in midwifery, you have insights, and then you go out and confirm it. Yeah. Right. But right, right. this is puzzle. This is different, and it's or I think so. Well, it's, it's the we. Yeah. I don't know. It's not just you. You're engaging others to achieve something. You want to confirm whether you can go with others to achieve this goal that you set for yourself that may, in fact, help people who are in danger. Yeah. Well, I've got all the steps except the last one. Right. Um, and you're asking, what's it like to say the we had? Or, or, or I'm missing your, okay, yes, we had to confirm it. Mm -hmm. Or that was the next step, to confirm yeah. it. So yeah. it's left unconfirmed. Okay. Uh, what is it like working with people to, to complete some idea that you think is significant?
Depends. Um, many times it's been extremely difficult. Right. Right. But somehow this idea got past that. That's right. So in the past you've had difficulty, and this dream is saying you had get an agreement with others. And now you have Not to even an it. agreement. It was a, it was like they recognized it as obvious too, yeah. as as. But why do you think you have trouble working with people? You mentioned that a moment ago. I don't have trouble working with people. Okay. I, oh, reaching well. my goal, I think, I in order to sometimes attain my goal, I I water down the goal. When you're working with others. Yeah, because you see that they're conflicted with certain things, oh. or um, they're not going along with it, right, or right, right. or so, they'll or so they'll have some disagreement. This dream is an achievement, isn't it? Because it doesn't carry all of those past conflicts. No, it doesn't. Right, 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 right. Maybe it's myself with myself. <laughs> I'm doing better with myself. Uh, yeah, I with don't know. others. Yeah, I don't know. We had to try it. That's right. Where does it go? See, I asked you a moment ago whether you, you might have had difficulties in the past working with others to achieve some goal, and you mentioned these difficulties that you mentioned, and it was well, well described. And then we contrasted it with the dream. And those difficulties didn't occur in the dream, did it? No. Therefore, that's an advance, isn't it? Mm -hmm. But now you have to now try to achieve. And the dream is leaving you to wonder about. Doing it. Yes. I don't know where this goes. Um, so, um, <clears throat> have you recently given a, 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 a paper? Not yet. Oh, I, pres I submitted one. Oh. How does that fit? Are you trying to get others to go along with an idea you're presenting? Yeah. I'm going actually in several places. Oh. At work as well as paper. Oh. Right. At work and... Uh, um, you mean you're going to have to face this issue in several places? Um, Danger, though I'm just not puzzled. I'm puzzled about danger, like what that all means. Yeah, there's an element of danger, but not to you, but no. on their side. On the people upstairs, yeah. on the upper levels. Yeah. Um, that's where the real danger is. Yeah. Are you going to be uh, then trying to move people towards some goal? Yeah, well. That's going to be helpful. Hopefully, it might bring others to the same thing. On the upper levels. Yeah. Or address upper level issues. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. You said that well. You just saw something. What did you see? Well, that. Well, the paper I submitted would was pretty forthright and outlined very clearly what I was planning to do. Now, please use the word upper, well, upper yes. levels. Up, uh, are they uh, upper level problems that they have? 
yeah, be, a recognizing, um, well, recognizing midwifery, mm -hmm. which is. The mailbox. The, um, hmm, yeah, that's one. Um, how, how do you feel about meeting these people and presenting these ideas? Oof. The way I set it out? Scared. Yeah. Scared. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's easy what's to... The, what's the dream say? You're not scared in the dream? No, I'm not at all. What do you think of that? It goes against your fears. Yeah, I'm thinking that... I don't know if this relates it was a uh, discussion I had regarding I don't know if that relates or not uh, regarding a um, woman at work who um, Uh, could be mm -hmm. <laughs> I got it. that uh, she's quite hostile. Yeah, I got it. But I did find a way to relate to other people regarding it. Oh, I see. And I will be meeting some people on Tuesday. Right. Regarding it. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. I've got several things in the pile here. Thank you. I'll watch my dreams. Okay. Oh, weird. These are my notes. Do you want to? Keep oh, them? thanks. Okay. Very penetrating. Yeah. Very <laughs> okay. Happy. Yeah. Thank you. I don't know if I understand that whole. It's puzzling to me. I. It's like the this. I don't know if it fits, but this lady pretty much is hostile and trying to portray me in a certain picture light. I'm old. I've already done all, you know, I, I think in old terms. The subject matter is not old. <laughs> but I just went ahead and said, okay, well, I talked to one person and I said, well, I'd be very happy to work with you. And then I talked to another coach and I will be seeing him on Tuesday and also I will be working with another c counselor so I'm not so I'm getting around this lady I don't know if it'll work but there is some danger because of um, well not really <laughs> what's the paper that you're doing? What's the paper I'm doing? Okay. Uh, what's the, the paper? Proposal, the paper. Uh, what's the paper? Hmm, don't remember what it was. <laughs> There's two of them. Uh, deals with philosophical midwifery and dreams and daydreams. Uh, no, dreams and daydreams. No, fantasies and daydreams. I think. And, uh, and that. Going to and what's it suggesting? You're asking me, and I don't remember all the content. Um, it's going to the California Psychological Association, and I am outlining uh, the problems with interpreting dreams as well as presenting philosophical midwifery as a non-interpretive method. Uh -huh. And, it's a non-interpretive uh, method of what? Dreams and daydreams and fantasies and, yeah. And problems? Or only problems in the context of emerging from dreams? Didn't talk about that. Okay. I don't know. Just how cool. it can relate to... Um, I don't remember how I outlined it. Sorry. That's upper floor. <laughs> yeah. And what's the second paper? or proposal.
uh, it's not a proposal, it's a paper for just writing about interpreting, in interpretation of dreams and non-interpretation of dreams. In, you're giving it to a coach? No, no, no. I don't know right now. It's just writing a paper that I had already presented, but I'm writing it up. And that's the one that you're going to discuss with the coach? Oh, no. You talked yeah. about Tuesday you're going to go and... Oh, that's a whole different subject. Oh, I don't want to get into that. That's kind of policy, politics stuff. But it's a coach regarding how to relate to how student problem, how the problems of the students need to work, how we can work better with the students and their problems. Cool. Yeah, that's all I wanted to oh, know. Okay. I don't need to know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Lies and policy. I'm really glad you're taking the library. I don't get a chance to say that again. Oh. <laughs> I mean, you know, I mean, things can happen at the end. Yeah. Oh, the, the, the this is not me. Oh, really? Well, by December. Cool. That is so great. I think it needs more work. It's like ants. Yeah. It's You guys with like 30 boxes of That's truck, truck or car? Yeah, we have like, yeah, we put the well, seat down. Like oh, yeah, there's plenty of room for those yeah. inside of yeah. it. So, the, um, the, the cardboard box, not the white, have really good lids on them, but they're underneath. So okay. you have to lift up the boxes and take the lids off. Okay. Them, if, if you have to put anything back in the truck. Okay. The, okay. the other ones have, the white ones have really light and it's very good. Yeah, yeah, we'll organize and, and the folks aren't going to blow away. Okay. Yeah, it's covered. Yeah, so, yeah, we should be able to get them in there pretty good. Okay. Okay. All right. Thanks for doing that. We won't unload it, but we'll have the guys yeah, at home to do yeah, that. Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, we'll just load it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry I'm not going to be there, but it's... What do you make of the family? I'm going a little dolly with me, so... Thank you. you know, we're talking about you brought me stuff. On. Yeah. <laughs> I have a question. Why did you Get ask to work. me about the papers? Because we've asked you many times, and often you don't share what you're doing. I share any time. No, every time, time I'm asked. <laughs> so okay. every yeah, time I'm asked. That, that share and so I'm going every time I'm asked, I share. share is not if I have a title, if I have a topic, if I have a translation, I share. That's what you think? Yep. Good. Well, Remember I'm, I'm me questioning. a time when that's not the case, and I'll be happy to deal with it. Good. I will remember that. Jeff, uh, <coughs> sir, thank you for the dream. It strikes me that this is a very familiar state, mm -hmm. but what's interesting uh, in, in waking life, but what's interesting, well, this is just a final scene of several scenes in a dream, but I couldn't remember them. But what's interesting just from this final scene is that I don't have, that I'm angry, but I don't know what she has said. I mean, she's accused me apparently of something. I don't know what it is. Uh, And I notice also that I'm, at the end, it's important to me that she get my message. And it's bothering me that she's not. Yeah. We're, we're just talking over each other. We're just yelling at each other. So there is no real communication going on. <clears throat> Thank you. 
like I, you know, I can't get the last word in. I can't get any understanding on her part. She's just, it's just a, you know, it's just two heads budding. Yeah, and it's important for you to, as you said, uh, how'd you put it? I, I, yeah, it's a very familiar state of frustration growing up. I, I feel like I can't get the other person, usually my mom or dad, yeah. to either see what I'm saying or admit that they see what I'm saying. What do you think of them? What do I think of them? Yeah, yeah, yeah. On yeah. what level? What do you think of them? Um, Uh, is that going on in the dream? Looks like it. Yes. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah it is. Yeah, yeah, uh -huh. yeah. Uh, Wonder why you're getting the dream now. But uh, yeah, go back to that thought. <clears throat> we get a front burner and a back burner question. <laughs> Yeah, what do you think of the fact that uh, <clears throat> you're, you're expecting something or would like something to result? To agree? Like, have a, I'd like something to happen. Uh, <clears throat> and you said well, it very it's, well, it's important for me, just etc. Yeah, as I sit here now, I see, in a sense, I'm giving my power up to this person. Hmm. Because if I'm waiting for her face to change or his face to change, oh, I got it, oh, I see now, right? That kind of thing. If I'm waiting for them to get it and then go, oh, mea culpa, right? And they don't, yeah. um, then I'm caught and snagged in, and, you know, I can't get out. So in a way, I'm giving my power up to them. Yeah, what do you think of that? <laughs> It's beyond the fact it's a form of slavery and that I must have learned it somewhere. I, I don't know how yeah, much more to answer. Yeah, you may be right, but I, I don't see those steps yet. Uh, okay. Yeah. In the dream, uh, could you just go over that moment? Uh, um, well. She's not listening. Could you just read it from that point on? And I'm furious, but as I'm saying this, she won't stop her own tirade. So we're both just yelling at or over each other, and she's not listening to what I'm saying. Keep going. So I just want to strangle her because she's such an asshole, but of course I can't do such a thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Finish it. But I am so furious. What do you make of that? that? You're so furious given that condition. I mean, you see, she's not going to listen. You're not going to be able to change what she's doing. Uh, what do you make of the fact that you're furious? Well, it looks like it goes back to that statement you made about your family. Yeah, I, I'm not being heard. And that's why I'm angry. Uh, but, I mean, if I were going to take a, a purely, I mean, it's not, on another, on one level, that makes sense. But on another level, I mean, you know, I'm not being heard. Come on, fuck, wake up. But on another level, it's uh, somewhat irrational because if a person is not listening and they're not showing any evidence that they want to and, and you're at an impasse and you can't think of anything else to do, those are lots of ifs. Uh, I mean, I certainly could try another approach or I could say, we're done here. Uh, Therefore, we're curious about why you're furious. That's right. Yeah. So if you take the second approach, th then right. you have to ask, right. uh, what's the fury about? Which is why I was trying to go back and answer it 
the best I could, which is I'm not being hurt. Um, and there's a sense of an injustice there. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. Because I feel like I've heard what she had to say. I don't judge it to be true or yeah. fair. Yeah. Why aren't you hearing what I had to say? Yeah. <clears throat> um, how come you get to say what you want to say, but I don't? Um, uh, but that's true. That is unfair in that respect. But uh, aren't you going to give an account of why that makes you furious? Say, that reminded you of your life at home. It's important for me to be heard. If you know that, what follows? If, if I know that, that it reminds me of my life at home? To be heard. Oh, if I know that I'm not going to be heard, yeah. what follows? Yeah. Then there's no reason to speak, or <laughs> essentially. <laughs> uh, there's another alternative. Okay. I mean, I... I can certainly ask them, why aren't you listening? Well, uh, yeah. What, what's so hard for you to, to hear another person's point of view? Mm -hmm. Better. And in the same way, what could you tell your parents? What could I or what did I? Both. When I was a child? Right on. Um, well, those are different questions. I, um, I never told my parents, you're not listening. Um, except maybe once when I got high, I was already in college and I, <laughs> I ran into my mom in the kitchen. I was, but I don't remember the actual words of that conversation very much, but I... So do they know what it does to you? They know. At some level, they know. They know. Uh, what does that mean? Um, it means I agree to let them stay in their box, and I've come along in their box with them, and they know all of this. Okay. And we can talk about countertops and patios and bullshit. Bullshit. But that leaves them in their box. What would you have to say about their box? To them? Yeah. What scares you about meaning? It's good. More. Oh, could you what ask scares them? you about connection? Yeah, more. Yeah, 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 yeah. Aren't you sad that your whole life has been a waste? Good. Good. Could you uh, also ask them where they finish it? Did you feel like I'm feeling now when you were a kid? Yeah. Was it done unto you as you are doing unto me? Mm -hmm. Did you try to avoid doing that with your own kids and yet you ended up doing exactly the same thing? Yeah. <laughs> That's the irony of it all. Everybody knows the game they're playing. They wish to hell they couldn't play it. They wish to hell they would stop. Yeah. It doesn't make any difference. They play it out unless they're challenged in such a way that they have to see what they're doing. You've got the power. We all have the power. They have the power. Right. But that's part and parcel of the thing itself. Yeah. It really is. Yeah. 
that is same. the box. Yeah, say more about it. Is not claiming the power. That's right. Hmm. It's making believe you're weak and powerless when in fact, yeah. you have it all. We all have it all. We all have it all. We just want to pretend we're ants. That's right. Then we fit. Then we fit. Yeah. Beautiful dream. Brought it all together. Say the last one again. Beautiful dream. It brought it all together. Yeah. It really does. What's nice about it is you see you achieved all your goals. You got the shoes. You then dealt with her. Where it broke down, of course, is... Yeah, that's... Just at that one point of how do you deal with someone who won't listen. Say, you ever get in Plato's Republic? You find that interesting, that that's the beginning of the Republic? Are we talking uh, Thrasymachus? This, not this is the, uh, the boy or the slave, what you, or whatever you want to call him. Oh, at the very beginning. Yeah. Um, can we? It's a kidnapping. Yeah. Right. He says, hey, can you persuade those who won't listen? Yes. No. So go ahead and give it to him. So he takes them all on, all the kidnappers. But That's the, the implication then is that he's listening. Yeah. And he forces them to speak. So he turns the table on them. Right. Good old table turn. I'll have to think on that for a while. <laughs> Thank you, PG. Much appreciated. <laughs> yeah, good dream. Yeah, lovely. What do you make of dreams being so insightful? It's a... Uh, Astonishing, isn't you can't it? Stay very, you can't stay depressed for very long. Nope. It says a lot about the cosmos. Yeah. Isn't it interesting how love and logos go together? Yep. That's right. Yep. Major. But courage takes apart. <laughs> and yet, when it's done, you say, what the hell did it? it didn't take courage. I just said what the hell I wanted to say. Yeah. Curious, isn't it, Julie? Really? Yeah. What do you think David would say about it? He would say, uh, not much. He would say, not much.